hello everybody welcome back to my channel it's m please do remember to subscribe to my channel please do remember to share the video and uh, leave any comments um i would like to thank those who have already subscribed to my channel uh today i want to talk about a very important issue uh, a very important you know um a uh, nervous problem uh, I'm going to talk about stroke you know what blood is carried uh, all over the body uh, and blood carries nutrients and oxygen to all cells and we all know that cells are these tiny little structures which are all over our bodies and this is where the blood goes to so that our organs can function. Even the brain has some cells. The heart has some cells. And so, uh, the brain is called, is part of the nervous system. It is a very, very complex organ. Because the brain controls uh, most of the activities which happen in our bodies. Uh, that's why it's, it's said to be the nervous system. So we have nerves running all over our bodies. And imagine, we have uh, various senses. And these are carried, or these are detected by the nerves. We have sense of smell, sense, uh, we have sight, we have sense of taste just to name a few so that's why we are saying the brain is a complex organ sometimes uh, like any other part of the body the brain can face some problems so uh, this uh, uh, problem I'm going to talk about which is called stroke is a problem which can occur uh, sometimes and uh, when our brain is not functioning properly. So, the problem of, of, um, of stroke is quite common. Uh, when uh, someone experiences stroke, that means something has gone wrong with this important organ. So, stroke is caused by, uh, for example, one can have a clot in the brain and that can cause a stroke. And one can have like bleeding in the brain and that is a cause of stroke. So a stroke, you know, happens or occurs when blood supply to a part of the brain is cut off. So we need the blood to be continuously circling, you know, from the heart, going to all parts of the body, going to the brain. So when the supply of blood is cut off and the blood cannot reach a part of the brain, then a person can end up having what is called a stroke. So we need to be mindful of that. So this is just an awareness, just to, you know, to be aware of what really happens. We all maybe have heard about stroke, but we don't, some of us don't really know what's happening. So, it's when a part of the brain is not receiving uh, blood. So, the cells will, uh, will like go into limbo. They cannot receive any blood, so they won't function. So, it's very, very uh, important you know, to, to know what to do when one is being overcome by a stroke. So a stroke is a very serious condition. It is also a medical emergency. So what should we do? When we have symptoms and signs of a stroke, we should be uh, very, very alert and, you know, seek medical, uh, medical, you know, help. Because a stroke is a medical emergency. So we need to seek help from our physicians and from the doctors. So how do we know that we have a stroke? 
there are symptoms of stroke. So I have about four examples, uh, about uh, three examples of these, uh, you know, symptoms, the signs that maybe something is going wrong. Uh, if you feel or if anyone feels or you see or you happen to have a, a face which is dropping aside, it's like one side becomes like longer than the other side, a dropping face. That is a sign or a symptom that you might be having stroke. So we need to know these symptoms. And the other one, when you are overcome by stroke, you'll be unable to lift your arms. You can't just lift your arms. They, uh, they, they, they can't even you know, move. And your arms are just on your side or, and you can't even use them. So that's another symptom of stroke. So like I'm saying, you need, we need to have an awareness of what's going on in our bodies. So if we have the, like the knowledge or this, we, we understand about stroke, then we can easily help our friends and relatives. And even, you know, our friends and relatives, if they know what stroke is, they can help us. So awareness is very, very important in any medical condition. Another condition, another, you know, symptom is when you have stroke, your speech becomes slurred. You cannot, you know, you cannot uh, speak and produce the words like you normally do. So if you are having a, a, a stroke, that will happen. The speech becomes slurred. The words are not coming out. So those are the, you know, the three main signs that someone maybe is having a stroke. So like I said, stroke is a medical emergency. It usually it's best to go to a hospital where the, uh, the physicians or doctors, uh, you know, treat you or give you some medical interventions. So it's very important for all of us to be aware of what's going on in our bodies. So I hope you have enjoyed this short presentation. So to sum up, um, this is just in conclusion. We know stroke happens when part of the brain is not receiving blood because we know blood carries oxygen and nutrients. So when a part of the, of the brain is not receiving uh, blood, then we must be, you know, it might lead to a, it usually leads to a stroke. And uh, the symptoms of stroke, this is just to sum up. I've, I've identified, you know, you know, researchers and experts have, you know, come up with these examples. When you're having a stroke, the face will drop. So it's called face dropping on one side. So face dropping on one side. That's a symptom or a sign that something is going wrong in the nervous system. Another one, unable to use your, your arms. You can't lift them. They're just on your sides. You can't lift them. So that's another symptom. And the third one I've, told, I've identified is slurred speech. You try to speak, but you can't, you know, you can't, you know, say out the words. So that's another sign that uh, maybe one is having a stroke. So uh, this is uh, just an awareness so that we are aware of what might go wrong in our nervous system. So I hope you have enjoyed this presentation. So please like the video, share the video, and to anyone new, please subscribe. Thanks for watching for now.